There is a groundbreaking development in Africa. A massive crack in the ground that's estimated to be up to 50 feet deep has opened up in Kenya seemingly overnight. The crack stretches along Kenya's Great Rift Valley, and many scientists believe it could end up splitting the continent apart. The rift is several miles long, and some believe it is a sign the continent is splitting in two. Fortunately, this does not occur instantly, so it's going, we're, we're many tens of millions of years away from having two continents. Africa is breaking apart. This is not a theory. It's a geological fact. The process has already started, and in time, it will split Africa into two continents. This isn't just about cracks in the ground. This is about the birth of a new ocean, the redrawing of world maps, and the future of millions of people. Africa sits on top of the African plate. But that plate isn't whole. It's splitting into two, the Nubian plate to the west and the Somali plate to the east. This is happening along a massive fault line called the East African Rift System, stretching from Ethiopia down to Mozambique. It's over 3,000 kilometers long. This is called continental rifting, and it's the same process that once broke up the supercontinent Pangaea, creating the continent we know today. In 2018, in Narok County, Kenya, a massive crack opened up in the earth. It was 15 meters deep, stretching for kilometers. People were shocked, roads split, farmlands were cut in half. And while that crack wasn't the start, it was a powerful reminder that this process is very real and very active. In Ethiopia's a far region, you can physically see the earth tearing apart. Volcanoes like Erta Ale are part of this transformation. New land is forming, and magma is pushing up beneath the surface. If this continues, and it will, scientists predict that in the next 5 to 10 million years, the rift will become so wide that seawater from the Red Sea and Indian Ocean will pour in. A new ocean will form, and the Horn of Africa, including part of Ethiopia, Somalia, Eritrea, Kenya, and Tanzania, will split off from the rest of the continent. That new landmass will become its own continent. Smaller, yes, but entirely separate. The African continent will never be the same again. This isn't just about geography. The East African Rift runs through areas with growing cities, agricultural zones, and millions of people. Rifting causes earthquakes, volcanic activity, and ground instability. Infrastructure in countries like Kenya, Tanzania, and Ethiopia is already feeling the strain. It also affects water systems. Lakes like Tanganyika and Malawi were formed by rifting. New lakes are forming. Old ones are shifting. Ecosystems are changing. Governments and scientists are watching closely. This isn't a distant future. It's an active, ongoing process. What's happening now has happened before. 180 million years ago, Pangaea began to break. That split created the Atlantic Ocean. It separated Africa from South America. Back then, the process took millions of years. But today, we can monitor it in real time with satellites, GPS, and seismic data. We're witnessing what used to take entire epochs unfold piece by piece, year by year. This is a story of Earth's power, reshaping the planet from the inside out. It's a story of science, of history, of the future, and we're living through it. If this video made you think, then it's your turn to act. Like the video, share it, leave a comment below. And if you're hungry for more deep dives into African history, science, and the forces shaping our world, subscribe now. This is Afriai, where the story of Africa comes alive.